It's time to dive into some Miami Dolphins news. For years, the offensive line has been a concern for our team, constantly criticized by fans and analysts. But hold on to your seats, because here's a surprising stat for you. In 2022, the Dolphins only allowed a total of 35 sacks, tied for the ninth fewest in the entire NFL, alongside the Las Vegas Raiders. You might be wondering how this happened. Well, it's a combination of factors. Firstly, our quarterback, Tua Tagovailoa, has shown great pocket awareness, evading pass rushers and making quick decisions. His ability to get rid of the ball swiftly has contributed to the low sack count. If this trend continues in 2023, when Tua is healthy, he'll once again be able to minimize the impact of our offensive line on the game. But what about the running game, you ask? Last season, we ranked 18th in the league in yards per rush, averaging 4.3 yards per carry. Not too shabby, considering we didn't have a scrambling quarterback boosting those numbers like the Chicago Bears, Buffalo Bills, and Baltimore Ravens did. They had quarterbacks who used their legs effectively as weapons for their offenses, which helped them secure top spots in rushing statistics. Sure, being the 18th ranked rushing attack isn't exceptional, but it's not as dire as some may think. Now, imagine if our offensive line takes a step forward this season. According to Mike McDaniel and other Dolphins coaches, Liam Eichenberg and Austin Jackson, the linemen who worried us the most, showed improvement before their injuries last year. Can these two underperformers finally have solid, injury-free seasons under the guidance of our new offensive line coach, Butch Berry? If they can, it will be a significant boost for our offense, building on the progress we made last season. Even if you have concerns about our starting offensive line, fear not. We've strengthened our depth with the signings of experienced players from around the league. Former first-round tackles Isaiah Wynn and Cedric Ogwehi have joined the team, providing competition for starting roles. And if they don't make the starting lineup, they'll serve as reliable insurance in case of injuries. Don't forget to subscribe for more fantastic Dolphins content. See you in the next one. Go Dolphins!